There are two ways to navigate to your Bugsnag settings. You can click on Settings in the navigation bar to access the project settings, or you can click on your user icon in the top right corner to access your global account settings. Within your account settings, you can generate personal auth tokens for API access, manage recovery codes, configure two-factor authentication, and customize your email notifications. Email preferences can be set for all projects or individual projects, and you can choose the types of notifications you receive for each project. Project summary emails are sent on a daily or weekly basis, and other notification types are filterable by severity, handled or unhandled, and release stages. Typically, we recommend customers set up email notifications for new errors, regressions, rate spikes, and collaborator mentions, filtered by the error severity, unhandled exception type, and production release stage. Other notification types are better suited to chat integrations, such as Slack, which can also be configured and managed from settings. Beyond integrations with chat tools, Bugsnag can also integrate with issue trackers, such as Jira, to automatically open tickets when new errors are received, on-call systems such as PagerDuty to alert you about error spikes, and data forwarding services such as Splunk or Amazon SQS for in-depth data analysis. For custom integrations, we recommend setting up a webhook that Bugsnag can post error information to. In the project settings, you can manage custom filters, integrations, collaborator access, release stage visibility, and error processing rules. Error processing rules allow you to customize error grouping or discard errors before they show up in your inbox. Click on Collaborators to invite new users to Bugsnag or to view a full list of the collaborators in your account. Other information accessible via settings includes your organization details, plan and billing history, and event usage metrics.